Something important about this type of conference is to see that we are not a minority, that there is enough of us to fill a very big room. Often we can be just a very few of us. There are still big numbers and soon we're not going to be a minority in most fields. It's nice to see that there is so many of us. We really had two goals for this conference. One was to feature the research of early career women and then help them get feedback and discussion from more senior women and men uh, in their field. And then the second was to kind of facilitate networking for early career women. There just was a lower density for us sort of in terms of networking and connecting. I think that really to me, that was the, one of the most tangible things that I could feel, that maybe I couldn't even anticipate that that was sort of lacking. We never have that chance that we had here to connect with so many other female economists. And there was just something that felt special about that that was only really possible by that conference that normally just isn't as easy. This is a nice way for people to meet others in their field as well and kind of get advice that I think there is kind of differences in how men and women are treated in the profession, the kind of challenges they face and so on. For a lot of people who came, I think they're the maybe the only woman or one of two women in their whole department. And to, to come and then have a mentor readily available who's like not just one, but maybe several who are there specifically for them, I think is, is kind of special and, and really nice. As a woman who came up through, uh, you know, through the profession when there were very few women, I can tell you that networking was just uh, extremely important in my career. So I think giving women the opportunity to get feedback, to make networks, to you know, talk about their ideas, um, that's what this conference is all about and I think it's extremely important. We also had a very strong intent to feature work that we thought was innovative in the way that it either used data or collected data. There was a lot of very, very creative thinking about empirical work in a way that I haven't seen at many conferences so well represented. I think it was a very unique conference in that it was uh, sort of small enough that you got a really a chance to meet people and have good conversations with them, but then also expansive enough that it you got to learn about a lot of different topics and see different kinds of presentations. So it's really great to see what other women in economics are doing that are in maybe slightly different fields than mine. There's a huge variety of research about uh, zoning policies, about sort of wartime conflict. There's just a huge broad spectrum of things that I don't normally get to read, but it's super interesting. There aren't so many occasions where people from different fields come together, and so Paula and I work on quite different topics, and so we wouldn't, outside of this conference, have so many opportunities to kind of come together and reflect on what we've learned and how our research has evolved. I think that's quite unique because typically we are in like very like field specific conferences and we don't see, we are not exposed to this like wide variety of topics and tools. And I got to finally meet in person a lot of people I really admire and I think it was super valuable. Here you can feel that there is a different vibe. Building a, a, a richer and bigger network of uh, women in economics and knowing that you have a lot of people to ask for feedback, that you can also give a lot of people feedback and, and just getting to know each other's work. I think it's very fruitful for everyone. The fact that you see that some of the organizers uh, are not from the university, uh, I think it tells you that the university, and in particular the BFI, is a place that is very open to making like the best research and bringing the best researchers and the best ideas to Hyde Park. So in that sense, that is also something that's amazing. I hope what participants took away from this is that even if they don't see women every day in their department or in their, in their same field, that there are a lot of women and that we have similar experiences. Hopefully they have met at least one or two people from this conference that they can reach out to for professional advice.